Hello, this is Beetle G, and I'm playing some Slay the Spire. Let's dive right in. All right, let's go. Let's go to this question mark. We might go to this shop right here. All right, let's see. Ooh, free strike. Oh, oh. All right. Well, GG. Not really. Doesn't do that great. So I guess this isn't fantastic in our deck just because we've done so many draw cards but we can do that and then just oh did not think that through it's interesting poison stab strike yep there you go there you go yeah all right Ooh. uh let's cast adrenaline so we can cast anything. Oh man, this is making me really regret Snekawai. Uh, let's see what this gives us. Let's get rid of that. That's too expensive. That's adrenaline. Maybe we can draw. Alright. Cheap. Bullet time. So I think let's. Neutralize and dagger throw. I guess neutralize doesn't matter. We would strike just to do more damage. Hmm. Okay. It's not turning out too badly. He hexes us, so whenever we play a non attack card, we shuffle one dazed into our deck. Okay, so we can do this to draw a card. He is still not attacking us. That's nice. Get rid of Piercing Whale. <laughs> so we actually don't need to use it because we only have three mana worth of attacks anyways. Disappointing, to say the least. All right. Come on. Come on. Uh, oh, man. We're going to be taking all high cost stuff because this, this hurts. Look at that. Three is supposed to cost zero. Hmm. So I think neutralize and survivor is the turn. That is really <sighs> not what I want to be doing. He's almost dead though. I wonder if you can get this earlier, if it's just a boss item, it, uh, the Sneko Eye. It'd be cool. Ooh, look at that. Free. Or one cost. E, this turn's gonna give me a lot of... Oh, I really don't want to take that damage. Oh, uh, let's fire him. <laughs> you fired. Exhaust all status cards. And the these aren't good. Flying knee. Flying knee might be good just to give us the energy to cast our cards. Ugh. In front of you sits an altar to a forgotten god. Atop the altar sits an ornate female statue with arms outstretched. She calls out to you, demanding sacrifice. So we can offer the golden idol, so we won't get the extra gold, but we'll receive a special relic, which I have no idea what it is. Gain five max HP. Eh. Or become cursed for no reason. Uh, let's do it. Let's trade them. As you gently set the idol onto the altar, a cold wind swirls throughout the room. The arms of the statue begin to discolor and crumble. Your golden idol begins to dull in color and begins bleeding from its eyes. Oof. The bleeding never ceases. Bloody idol. Whenever you gain gold, heal 5 HP. That is fantastic. That means every battle we can heal 5. We're basically the ironclad now. That is awesome. So, what? Do I want to take a card out of this deck? Do I want to take... Oh, no, I want to keep bullet time. That's the only thing keeping this deck playable. I could take a strike out. Um, I, I think I like the relics more. Or, well, potential for relics. I like to be optimistic. We'll get those relics. Oh, my Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Every Yeah, yeah, that, that sounds great. Um... 
Let's cast this for free. Bring that down a little bit. Let's cast this for free. That's not doing much. Oh, this this might be it, guys. What the heck is going on here? He's going to do eight. We can block. And dagger throw. Oh, my God. Buddy. I'm disappointed. I thought this was going to be so much better. Oh. Uh, Yeah, let's use this. Oh my god, I always forget. I need to use that last. Okay. So our bullet time turns are amazing. Like, they they always work really well. It's every other turn where we don't have it is the problem. Like, look at this. Okay, we have a, a ton of cards. Great. Um... We can't do anything. We do have four energy. I guess Flying Knee to set up next turn as well. Poison Stab. Gets through the shield a little bit. Ooh. Ah, but see, retaining them will keep them at the price they are. So, we can retain well-costed stuff. We don't want to retain, like, three-cost things. Free bullet time. Let's go. Oh my god, I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. I can't, I can't believe how dumb I am. Just don't use those first. We only take three here, and then we can heal five from the idol. This is it's working out. It's definitely working out. We can do 29. Let's just draw that freaking... Um, <laughs> that was just draw two. Hmm. That's 12. I'm not using a three cost block. Alright, we're, we're safe. Um, Poison Stab or Dagger Throw? Let's do Poison Stab. I'm lying. Let's do Dagger Throw. Oh, discard. Oh, I should have kept it. Ooh, I'm really dumb. I'm really, really dumb. Also, I should have kept Poison Stab. That would have just killed him. God damn it. Um, Mulligan. Yeah. Gives us a free turn to draw the kill. Or just play one of these. Wait. Am I dumb? No, 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 no. He had eight. I don't know if we could have killed him. But he's dead now. Perfect. Sorry if I keep hitting the mic. I literally just keep scraping my hand against it. Can't sound good. Ooh. Shut up, Acrobatics. You're not good in my deck. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want free things. Let's just quick slash. Oh, I, I don't know what's going on anymore in this run. Venturing through a series of tombs, you are faced with a large sarcophagus. Studded with gems in the center of a circular room, you cannot make out the writing on the coffin. However, you do notice black fog seeping out from the sides. Uh, let's get this relic. We only have a 50% chance. And, of course, we got it. Ooh. This is the best poison relic in the game. Whenever you get, uh, apply poison, apply another one. You push open the coffin. As you do, black fog spews forth and covers the entire room. Inside you find no body, only a relic. You take it and move onwards, coughing violently. Uh, so we would like to remove that as soon as possible. It starts in our opening hand, which sucks. Maybe this is a shop. <gasps> oh. As you attempt to sneak past a group of shrouded figures, a naked, red-skinned man approaches you. Got any jacks, friend? I got the shakes bad. Please, maybe some coin? He seems delusional, but harmless. Let's do it. We can spare 85. We get a relic. Start each combat with three shivs in hand. Ooh, buddy. Those shivs better be zero cost and not random cost. Otherwise, this is actually kind of a bad thing. Let's smith. Let's smith some stuff up. 
<gasps> Ooh, cheaper bullet time. That actually literally doesn't matter because of the Sneko skull. Um, shoot, what do we do, guys? Maybe get more poison up in up in there. Yeah, let's upgrade the poison guy. Um, or piercing whale. Piercing whale's next. I promise. All right. Let's try this out. Okay, cool. They're just free. Ooh, we are drawing way too many cards. Ah, these suck in this battle. Hmm. Those are literally not worth playing. I think we do want them out of our deck, though. And we can do a little bit more damage. All right. Hmm. Okay. Again, we can heal five. That's not a big deal. Ooh, bullet time. Let's, uh... Ugh. Ugh. God. Okay, let's use it. Stagger throw. Fudge. Can I, can I please gain some brains so I can stop doing that? That really hurts. Every time. That's like five whole damage we could have blocked. And we would have only taken one, and we wouldn't have lost two plated armor. Man, this is my wine, wine game. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stop. Get better, get better. Okay, so let's <laughs> pay one to draw two. Let's quick slash. Let's definitely flying me. And yeah, two cards to retain. Let's keep the free. And that's it. Okay, I think we can kill him this turn. I guess it really depends. It's a random deck. Ugh. Four. Eight. That's not good. That's really not good. Hmm. Let's keep that. <laughs> only going to do four damage next turn, too. Okay, we could just end up doing win. Hmm. Ninja scroll. Bullet time! <laughs> 14 gold. Here, heal five. You can only be played if there are no other cards in your hand. At the start of your turn, draw one card, discard one. I think we're gonna take this. This really helps if we if we have a card that's way too overcosted, we can just discard it and get a new card. Hey look, he's gonna randomize the cost of our cards. Please do. Mr. Man. Okay, let's draw. Okay. So I'm gonna use this one. Get rid of Ride. Now I'm gonna use bullet time. Strike, poison stab, defend, defend. Yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> let's end the turn so he can actually go. Perplex perplexing gaze. Oh, we're confused twice. They're doubly randomized. Free block. And we have some block. So we can tools. We can just, yeah, let's just set up. And then we can keep flying me. And that's it, because everything else sucks. We're fine. Vulnerable's fine. Okay, so we can discard this and draw a new card. Oh, oh, we drew the card, and then we have to discard one. Okay. So, this is actually looking pretty good. Lots of free stuff. So let's do that and draw a card. 
if we could draw bullet time, that would be awesome. And it would have to be less than three. Let's try it. Eesh. That's not good. That's not good. Hmm. Well, let's free. Let's free. Let's use that. Let's sit down a little bit. Ah, uh, yeah. We'll do that, discard that, and keep those two. One cost isn't too bad. Ooh, free bullet time. That is that is nice. Oh, what do we want to discard? Maybe yeah, let's discard prepared. We we can actually cast that. Can we cast it though? If we discard this? Cause I think I don't know what the hand size is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we'll be at eight. Oh no, we'll be at nine. Then we'll go down to eight, then up to ten. I don't think we can draw ten cards. I could be wrong. Let's try it, let's try it. Let's get rid of this. We can use that. Oh, it worked. Let's discard those two. And then we can bullet time. And we just get to go to go ham. We might actually kill him. Oopsie daisy. We could have killed him. But that's fine. We'll kill him next turn. And we're not taking damage, so it's not a big deal. We just need to do two damage. Done. Ugh. Always discard the curse. Spend all energy. If this card is discarded, deal 10 damage to a random enemy. See, that's pretty nice. But we're not doing a lot of discarding anymore. I mean, <laughs> we are, but... Ah, but this this might be cheaper. Yeah, and that'll set up nice turns. That actually works really well with bullet time as well because it's not drawing that turn, it's drawing the next turn. All right. I think we want to go this way. That seems awesome. All right, we got Ginger. No longer weakened. That's decent. Merchant. Ooh... That's a skill. Choose a skill from your draw pile and place it into your hand. So we could pretty much just have it sooner. I don't know. Deal 10 damage to all enemies. Draw one less card. Start with 10 block. Hmm. Uh, if we removed a card, we might remove prepared. We might remove prepared. Because it doesn't, it doesn't work too well anymore. Oh, let's remove writhe. That's that's what we want to do. The actually bad card. Ooh, this is not a fun battle. Hand is full. This is just draw two. Let's just keep beating this guy down. Ah, uh, we could have almost killed him. Okay. <laughs> I love their voice over the most terrifying caca. Ooh, look at this hand. That's a terrible hand. I don't know what to do here. <laughs> we literally can't cast anything. Well, we can cast that. I don't want to retain a single thing. It's all terrible. I'm so sorry, Sneko. I'm never taking you ever again. He might be. It might be better on Ironclad because Ironclad has more high cost cards. Like, oh my God, Sneko! I might actually make Demon Form playable. Imagine that. Look at that. Free Predator. That's awesome. 
Let's, uh, yeah, start with Quick Slash, because it'll let us draw a card. Bullet time. 20 damage. That's nice. I should have done the math. I'm pretty sure I could have used one of the strikes on this guy. I could be wrong, though. Just always give us freaking bullet time. If we can find another bullet time, that might actually be the best. <laughs> uh, these cards are terrible. Yeah, we'll block, stab, stab. Don't keep anything because it's awful. Tools of yeah, no, tools of the trade is great because when there are well priced things, we can keep them. Nice, nice. Choose a card to discard. Uh, let's discard one of these that cost three. We should have discarded the strike. Really gonna do this? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I guess so. We're discarding it all because I don't want it. Confirm. I'm really excited for when this game comes out of early access. It, I mean, it doesn't feel like an early access game. It's really, really well polished at the moment. Um, but I'm, I'm excited to see the the new, the third class. I, I can't even imagine what it would be. Uh, maybe some sort of spellcaster type. And it'll be neat to see. I, I would like to see like a an infinite mode where you can just keep going. Keep refining your deck. Um, sucker punch? Do we want to just keep adding on stuff? Applying one week is good. Yeah, let's get the weakness. Or the poison. Killing them quicker makes them do less damage to me. <laughs> alright. Yeah, oh, alright. <laughs> Changing the cost does not matter, because the cost is random, so... Uh, let's upgrade... Not that. I kind of actually want to remove adrenaline. It's not good. G giving the two energy might make it better, but I don't want to upgrade it. Let's just upgrade this. And uh, yeah, it would be nice. I I guess the uh, a run of this is quite long. Like it's over an hour. Uh, but it would be nice to see a couple more floors. I guess also in an abandoned temple, you find a giant book open riddled with cryptic writings. As you try to interpret the elaborate script, it begins to shift and morph into writing you are familiar with. Let's read it. Odd, the book seems to be about an ancient named Niao. This piques your interest, but you have a general feeling of malaise. Uh, read and lose HP. The Ancient of Resurrection Niao is exiled to the bottom of the spire. You feel compelled to read more, but your body begins to ache. Seeking vengeance, Niao blesses outsiders, using them for his own purposes. You are starting to feel weak and tired. Those resurrected by Niao remember only fragments of their past selves, cursed to fight for eternity. As you near the final page, your old wounds begin to reopen. Let's take the book, and it's the Enchiridion. Gives us a free power that costs zero at the beginning of the combat. So, I'm really curious how full our hand is and what gets pushed out, because I would love the free power. I don't care so much about our terrible cards. Also, I hope the free power is actually free. I don't think it's actually free. Oh my god. Oh, this is horrible. Okay, so let's shiv a little bit. Make some room in our hands. Let's start with bullet time. <laughs> I wonder if these stack. They totally do. Draw two and discard two. Our hands are going to be so full. Especially when we when we retain cards, 
This is going to be hilarious. Also, it's so disappointing that this isn't free. Ah. Uh, that makes this relic not so great. It just makes our hand terrible. Makes our um, deck terrible. Yeah, let's get rid of those. All right. Strike him. Kill him. One defend does enough. Dagger throw. Get rid of that. Neutralize. Okay. Ooh, and we can hold on to this. Oh. Maybe we should just burn it to burn his artifact stuff. I forgot he had that. <laughs> Our hand is so full. Alright, get rid of prepared. Everything's so free. This is awesome. He has 65 HP. What do we get rid of? This is good because it draws us cards. I want to use that, I think. Maybe just a strike? Maybe neutralize. No, 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 no. no I'm going to get rid of strike. Can we do some math? Weak will make it do 15. This will make it do... I think this applies first, so it takes it down to 14. This takes it down to, like, 11-ish. And then two of these will... Yeah, all right. Let's... Uh, let's the drama. Oh, right. Well, ooh, yeah. Shit. <laughs> I forgot that none of those would apply. No, I don't want that. But with 10 poison, he's dead in two turns. Two more turns. One more turn. Uh, and if we get a poison dagger... Yeah, there we go. Oh my god. We don't need those. Alright, let's go. Poison stab, he's dead. Cool. I'm <laughs> I'm liking bullet time a lot. Bullet time is cool. Deal five damage. Let's get out maneuver. Uh that could have been a bad mistake. It makes our next turn good. Uh, we might want to upgrade that. Um, let's heal. I'm not brave enough. I can't do this. With the random costs, I have no confidence in this at all. Though again, oh my god. It costs so much. Bullet time for free. So, I think we adrenaline. Uh, let's... That's a thousand cuts first. Then we adrenaline. Bullet time. Right? We could use the energy potion to prepared. Yeah. Pretty good turn. Pretty good turn. So, a thousand cuts was okay. It does it to all the enemies. Uh, we do want to get rid of these because they might take our. Um, stacking for 14. That's not good. And that's not good. Oh, yeah, get rid of the three. Uh, he might take. They might take our uh, bullet time, which would be terrible. All right, let's neutralize him. It didn't work. I'm sorry. <laughs> I forgot. I'm just going to get started killing them. Let's get rid of the... Alright. I want to keep that. Ooh. Let's get rid of this for now. Alright. 
All right, so we've blocked all the damage. That guy is going to die soon. Ooh, Predator would be nice. That's like the best card in our deck besides bullet time. What do you take? Quick slash? That's actually fine. I wish we'd been attacking this guy. Discard that because it sucks. That'll kill him. Yeah, why not? Oh, I hate myself. Oh, I misclicked. I attacked the main dude. Well, that's fine. I didn't want to. I don't want to attack him, anyways. Let's end the turn. We blocked it all. Let's keep the free one and let's keep that. All right. Oh, that's so dumb. That was the best time to kill him. Whatever. All right. We got a lot of stuff. We want to keep that. Um, let's get rid of that. Just because we can't cast that. And bullet time. Bullet time. Yep. Alright, we don't even have to attack him now. Uh, we want to use that last. Ooh. He is going to do a lot of damage. blocked at all. Sorry if I was so quiet. I don't remember talking. Um, this is not a tough fight. It's not as tough as I'm making it look. We have so much HP. Well, I guess he has a lot of HP too. Um, oh, I guess we don't really need this energy. <laughs> we drew it again. What don't we want here? We don't want to defend. Alright. That's bullet time. Maybe we should have used one of the... Oh, no, this is perfect. Oh, maneuver, dagger throw. No, 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 no. Poison stab, flying knee. Dagger throw, discarding this. And then dagger throw. Okay. I think we got this unlock. We can, we can even take 50 damage and we're fine. Oh, please. <laughs> You don't actually have to do 50 damage to me. That that would be nice if you didn't. Um, let's get rid of this expensive strike. I, oh, let's get rid of this expensive neutral eyes. Ah, but the weak. The weak. No, no, no. It costs too much. Okay. So, start with prepared. Everything costs so little. It's nice. Oh, yeah. There we go. Get rid of the expensive strike. Yeah, we want as much block as we can, I think. Oh my god, we have to discard two things. Um, doing damage isn't as important. Let's let's get rid of one of each. Alright, bullet time. We should have slashed first to draw a card. Fudge! I hate myself. Fifteen, so we're only taking thirty. One, yeah. Okay, that's half our health. That's fine. <laughs> that's fine. I don't want expensive poison stab. Ooh, predator though. I think outmaneuver than predator. It gives us the best chance of having a good turn. Next turn. Let's keep dagger throw, I guess. We can use it before we bullet time. Is that going to be free? No. All right. Choose a card to discard. Oh, that's so much damage. I 
don't want to discard any of these cards. They're all really good. Alright. Oops. I don't think we want these. All these defends. Yeah. I think this is a good hand. Alright. Uh, yeah. This Piercing Wheel and Neutralize will take a lot of that out of here. A lot of that damage out. There you go. Only 10 damage. I wish we'd kept one of them, I guess. <laughs> Next turn, we're going to have so much energy. This is going pretty good. Oh, I totally forgot to cut this into... Do a sign-off after the first boss. I really think I'm going to run these as, like, 20-minute episodes. Um, you guys can also let me know what you're what sort of schedule you are interested in that doesn't mean I'm going to follow it doesn't mean I'm going to listen to you at all but all input is helpful ooh that costs a lot um, we just have to do 10 yeah we did it alright that went pretty easily Storm of Steel. Discard your hand. Add one shiv to your hand for each card discarded. Doppelganger is pretty good. After image is fine. After image. After image is actually really good. Storm of Steel. Discard your hand. This is pretty good just because we can get rid of all of our high cost things and slam them. Mmm. That sounded better and better. These would be good together. Because the turns when we don't have bullet time, we're not actually playing many cards. We're playing like two or three. And then we only gain two or three block plus this. It's not anything to shake a stick at. but Let's go Storm Steel. I think that could be good. Cheap... We don't care about relics right now. I mean, I'd like them, but this is. We only have one more floor left. Healing might be the right choice. Maybe question card. Uh, so this gives us four choices instead of three when we kill somebody uh, for cards. This heals us. It would heal us about five every time we went to the campfire. Oh, it would heal us for ten. It's pretty good. Um, and this makes elites drop two relics, which is nice, but I only want to fight like maybe one more elite let's take let's take the question card we're healing from coins I do think more healing would be nice but this will be fine thanks for tuning in everybody we'll tackle the last floor in the next episode